We are using a bubble box which we designed. So it's a box like this where we have a plate uh, where the bubbles rise before, so in front of the plate, and we have the light from the back. And this allows us to measure the bubbles really accurate. We measure the PCO2, this is a dissolved CO2 in the water column, and we also measure the current velocities. And we can use this data to simulate where the CO2 goes to, so we get a footprint of the dissolved CO2. I think this place is perfect because you have uh, a bubble plume. So there are many of bubbles, not just single bubble streams, but of course the depth is different. So if you go to another place like the North Sea, you have deeper, uh, the seafloor is deeper, and then you get other physics, so the CO2 bubbles will dissolve quicker because the pressure is higher.